Hello guys, what's going on? Sean and Shake here. And today's video is going to be about the new content in Payday 2 Crime Wave Edition, which has come with the uh, the brand new Payday 2 The Big Score update. So I'm going to get straight into the game now and I'm going to show you what is new. I'm going to skip the uh, skip the up uh, the sorry, the introduction so we can get straight down to down to what's new in the game. I can't see anything new yet. <laughs> well, I wouldn't expect them to put in a brand new loading screen just for the game. So this is this is definitely new. I've, I've never seen this before. This cutscene. Okay. <clears throat> Payday 2 copyrighted 2016 Starbreeze AB. That's new. It said 2014 before on that loading screen, so we know that's new. Okay, I'm gonna skip this now. I just want to check that it's uh, the same as before. Yeah, it is. We can we can skip this. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is the same. This screen looks a little bit different. I can see that there are some. Um, some things have been compressed, I believe. There are less options than they were. I believe the skill trees were actually part of the main menu before, so this is different. I'm going to go into the inventory now. Yeah, this is this has definitely changed. The uh, layout is now the same as the PC. So, I can see now that skills and perk decks have been compressed into the inventory. Which is probably a good move, actually. Um, so, let's see. Characters. New characters. We have Jacket. We have Bonnie and we have Bodie. We also have Jiro and Sokol who are part of DLC packs. Jiro being part of the Yakuza character pack and the Sokol being part of the Sokol character pack, obviously. And we can see the preferred characters menu is now in the top right, which entails that you can pick four characters that you want to play as rather than just one. So you can see now my preferred character is Wolf. If I were to pick, say, um, Houston as my second preferred character, if Wolf is taken when you are uh, when you join a game online, then your character will automatically be set to Houston. In this case, however, if Houston has been taken, I'm going to make my third choice Jacket, for example. If Wolf has been taken, then it will set me to Houston. If Houston has been taken in that same game, then it will set me to Jacket. If if uh, Jacket has been taken, then it will set me to in this case Hoxton. So, uh, that's a. Uh, new that's a new feature which is very cool i like that feature masks let's see what new masks we have and yes there are 10 pages now 10 pages of uh, inventory space for masks whereas there was only one or one relatively long one probably about the size of three of these pages beforehand so let's see let's go down to the bottom is this I haven't seen these two masks before. I believe these may be new. Mark. Yeah, these are these are uh, Hotline Miami masks. At least Mark was. Alex. Alex is new. Anubis. There, yeah, these are these are all. Um, Aubrey's definitely a Hotline Miami mask. Uh, Aubrey makes small guns spawn on the map. I remember playing. Let's see. We've got Clover. Brandon. Uh, yeah, these are, yeah, these are Hotline Miami masks. That's brilliant. We get those for free. That's more than I thought. I, yeah, these are these are uh, Hotline Miami as well. Dennis, Don Juan, got Dragon there. Dragon begins. General Overkill. That's part of the Overkill uh, pack. Graham, Hothead, Jake, John, Rasmus. Yeah, these are all. Um, well, some of those, sorry, were were Hotline Miami. We have Richard's mask here. Richard Returns, which is um, uh, Jacket's mask, the, the uh, default mask that Jacket wears, and Richard Returns begins, so you can uh, alter Richard's uh, Jacket's mask, sorry, to however you'd like. Richter, Rutger, Speedrunner, yep, these are all uh, Miami masks. We've got the uh, US Presidents here. Lincoln. These these were already in the game, so I'll skip past those. Um, Tony's Revenge. That's a Hotline Memory mask. Tony is new. Um, Tony's got 
uh, Fist of Fury, if you remember from Hotline Miami. Let's see, at the bottom. That one is was already in the game, but I think from here, from Baba Yaga to um, what's at the bottom? Rudolph. Yeah, these are all these are all new. These are all um, besides the champ. I've seen the champ before, but the majority of these ones right at the bottom are in, were introduced. Sorry, in this recent. Even wow, that's quite cool actually. Even in <laughs> in the in the recent in the recent update. I might make that my mask, or this one, this one, yeah, that's very cool. Anyway, DLC, so we've got Butcher, uh, AK car mod pack, we've got Westerns, yep, Sokol, Alesso, Golden Grin, Gage Ninja, Chivalry, Yakuza, Gage Ninja again, Chivalry, Point Break, and these ones at the bottom, you need to buy all of the big score DLC to unlock them. And these are all off playing cards. That's quite a cool touch. I like that. Events, let's see. Um, these two at the bottom uh, were introduced with the um, Honey I've Shrunk the Heisters pack as their Halloween items. Yeah, I'm convinced these, these two are new. Infamous. I think um, there are some new infamy masks. I think these ones at the bottom are new. The balaclava definitely wasn't there before, so I'm going to assume from, that from here down to here, although I have seen the plague doctor and the butcher before. So some of these masks, which are marked red at the moment, are new. Apart from the heat, I've already got those. But um, yeah. Quite a few of these masks down here, I think, are new masks introduced in the update. And I believe there are 10 pages again. Yep, there are 10 pages for masks. Let's move on to uh, weaponry. Alright, let's see. 10 pages again, I believe. Could be. No, it's 10 pages again. Okay, that is good. Um, okay, let's see. Assault rifles. These two at the end here are new. I'm just going to see if there are any more that are new. AK-5, this is new as well. This is a new rifle. Um, anything else? It looks like that is the only new rifle for free in Payday 2 console update, the AK-5. These two are new as well. The Valkyria, which is part of Sokol's character pack. That is a clone of the AS Val. And another one, which is the Cavity 9mm, which is a clone of the Celtic Sub-2000. Very concealable as well, so good to use for stealth heists. And now we have the minigun, the Vulcan, which is part of the overkill pack, obviously. And I want to buy that now, but I'm not going to. I'm going to save it for later. Piglet Grenade Launcher, barbecue weapon pack, with, um, with the mods. Um, Flamethrower, which is part of the weapon, uh, barbecue pack as well. Western weapon pack's got the Plains Rider bow, the light crossbow, the English, uh, the, sorry, the gauge chivalry pack has the light crossbow, the English longbow, and the heavy crossbow. The only new shotgun for primaries is the um, stakeout 12 gauge, which is part of the barbecue weapon pack, and the uh, Jocelyn over under 12 gauge, which is um, part of it's part of Bonnie's Bonnie's character pack. This is what looks like a Beretta Silver Pigeon. It looks like that. Akimbo. Right, I can tell now there are new Akimbo weapons. There were only four before, as in the Chimano Compacts, the Cross Kills, the Bonettis, and the Deagles. But now we have the Chimano 88s, the Chimano Customs, and the Inceptor 45s, which look like HK USPs. And they were not in the game before, so I can tell that the um, 45s will be, the Inceptor 45s will be in the uh, secondaries as well. So we have the Repeater 1847, which is part of the uh, Western Weapon Pack. Lots of damage there. And the Leopard Saga 308, which is a um, clone of the Walther uh, WA2000. No new LMGs in primary. None that I notice. This RPK. I, I don't. I think the RPK is new actually. Oh, do I have any gadgets for. Uh, yes, this is new. The RPK. Light machine gun is new. 
Right, then let's look at uh, secondary weapons. First off, the pistols. Oh, SMG, sorry, my mistake. Um, let's see. Cross Vortex, uh, Cross Vertex even, is a clone of the Chris Vector, which is part of the Gage Ninja pack. And I'm really, I'm really sad that I missed out on this for it being new. Oh, I really want to get this, it looks really cool. Micro Uzi, part of the Yakuza pack. Is there anything else that's new here? Um, Jacket's Piece, uh, as you can see this is part of um, the uh, Jacket character pack, which is Jacket's Sidearm in Hotline Miami. And Pistols, do we have anything new? Um, okay, Interceptor 45, that's definitely new. That's a HP USP. Uh, Peacemaker, for Peacemaker 45, part of the Western Weapon Pack. Matter 357, part of the Alasso Heists. And the Baby Deagle, which is part of the Point Break Heists. Specials, we have the RPG-7, or the HRL-7 in-game, which is part of the Overkill Pack, obviously a clone of the RPG. And the Pistol Crossbow, which is part of the Gage Ninja Pack. Also very cool. There are no new secondary shotguns, which isn't too big a deal in my opinion, but, you know, some people would like some secondary shotguns, see melee weapons, bolt cutters they are new, uh, 50 blessings briefcase that is also new, the Ursa knife is new, Nova shank that's definitely new, I've never seen a toothbrush turn into a knife before, um, Ursa tanto I believe that is new as well, it's the class, the class shock, uh, shovel that's also new yeah, bolt cutters as I said, utility knife this is definitely new, that looks quite cool actually. It's like a, um, a standing blade. Um, let's see. These are already. These were already in the game. Um, Tater Masher. That oh, that's historic pack that was already in. Overkill. Uh, boxing gloves. They the boxing gloves were in the game before, but they have just been reskinned. So technically that is new. Dragon's cleaver. That's new. Carpenter's delight. This is um, part of the jacket character pack. Uh, Psycho knife. That wasn't in the game before. I think there's a reference there, look. Norman and Chucky's. Food to die for. Brilliant. Norman Bates and Chucky's. That was quite cool, actually. Clover Shillelagh, that's new. Um, Ding Dong Breaching Tool, that's new. Rivertown Glen Bottle, I know this is new. This is part of uh, Bonnie's character pack. This is ref in reference to Bonnie being an alcoholic. I wonder if that breaks when you hit something. That'd be quite cool. Spear of Freedom, uh, American Flag, right around a pole, this is definitely new. Um, utility Machete and Fire Axe, these are both new as well. And then we've got a lot of DLC weapons. Empty Palm Carter, which is uh, part of the Ninja Pack, obviously, because ninjas like hitting people with their bare hands. The Mother Forker, which is part of the Barbecue Pack, I like that, Mother Forker. Uh, selfie Stick, what's that say? The, self, uh, the Stick the Selfs. Ego Stick 2012. <laughs> That's quite cool. Yeah, quite funny. Um, jackpot Buckler Shield, Hockey Stick, Classic Baton, Diving Knife, Your Mine. What's this? Oh, it looks like a um, what do you call it? A branding, a branding thing. Um, metal Detector, Coopier's Rake, Scalper Tomahawk, Arkansas Toothpick, Okina One, uh, Star Sai, Shinus. Uh, Shinsakuto Katana, I butchered that. Switchblade, microphone stand, lots of lots of new stuff, lots of new stuff. That's brilliant, there are lots and lots of new uh, melee weapons introduced, which is really nice to see. Um, throwables, frag grenade, obviously, ace of spades, uh, molotov, javelin, shuriken, and dynamite. Whereas before, we only had um, we only had uh, the throwing uh, these frag grenades, sorry, as the uh, throwable weapons. So it's nice now that we have um, more than one throwable weapon. In the fact that we have two now, but there will be six available with DLC. So that's uh, that's great to see. Um, what else can we what else can we look at? ECM, uh, sorry, equipment. Equipment is the same. There are no new pieces of equipment. I wasn't really expecting any. Uh, no new armor. Again, wasn't expecting anything different. 
No new skill trees yet. I think that they um, they will introduce one of the uh, some of the new skill trees quite soon. I expect um, potentially with another update, which would be nice. Perk decks. I believe there'll be four new perk decks. Uh, no, there are five. Sorry, my mistake. There are five new perk decks. Sociopath is um, Jacket's perk deck. Um, from Hotline Memory. Uh, gambler is uh, Bonnie's, obviously since uh, Bonnie is a gambler. Grinder is Sokol's perk deck. Yakuza is um, Sori's um, perk deck. And Ex-President is Bodie's perk deck. I like that point break reference there, that's quite cool. Um, so that is all we can see in the character menu. Now let's go and let's go and see what what new heists we have. I'm gonna go on crime.net and see what we have. I can already see lots and lots of new new uh, new heists there. First world beneath the mountain. That's a uh, one of the um, Sorry, my apologies. That's one of the uh, Point Break heists there. So someone's already got some of the DLC. Uh, the Mall Crasher. Sorry, that's already part of the game. Uh, Cook Off, Lab Rats, Aftershock, Slaughterhouse, Meltdown. I don't know what this error screen is. First World Bank. Now I'm guessing what this is is the uh, servers are overloaded because of the amount of people that are currently playing this game. Whereas before the servers weren't really uh, challenged, but now that they will be, I'm sure. Lab rats, first world, beneath the mountain, aftershock. Yeah, these are all new. It's really nice to see this, these new heists that I've never played before, or well, some of them I've never played before. I'm gonna see if I can get out of this menu now. There we go. Go into a flying. There won't be any crashes there. Census workshop. This is a new one. Um, aftershock. Rats was already in the game. Hoxton Revenge. That's one that I've been really looking forward to playing. Hoxton Revenge. Getting uh, Hoxton's vengeance for the uh, the man who, uh, in his own words, fucked him. <laughs> Completely butchered that accent. I can't. I can't do an Eastern London accent. But uh, lots and lots of new new uh, new heists here, which is really nice to see. Car shop is a new one. I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing these. Cook off. Wow, this is great. This is a lot of content to take in at once, I must say. And giving it all to us in one go is gonna keep me playing this game for a long, long time in this case. So I'm really looking forward to getting on with this. See Slaughterhouse. Crazy job is already in the game. More crash was already in the game. I'm gonna go back to online because you can see more at once. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these on this screen are brand new. Probably more now. This is a lot to take in at once. Well, anyway, guys, I've showed you all that I can find that's new in this game. Um, obviously, this is not a lot of new content to take in at once. I can, if you'd like, if you'd like to see some gameplay from this game on the newer heists on console added to my videos if you'd like me to record some of that and show it to you guys on YouTube then please leave a, dis uh, leave a uh, recommendation in the comments of whatever heist you'd like to see I'll, I'll, re I'll listen to your comments, I'll respond to all of your comments and um, yeah this is a lot of content I must say well I guess I'm gonna be playing Payday 2 for a bit <laughs> Well, anyway, thank you a lot for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe, and until next time, keep shaking.